Folks in the Churchland area of Portsmouth are keeping a closer eye on who's coming in and out of their neighborhood. This after a high school student was allegedly assaulted on her way to the bus stop. It happened early this morning while it was still dark outside on Kenny Lane. And 10 on your side's Gina Revelo spoke with parents and has more. Anita, police say that girl wasn't hurt, but people out here are still very concerned because there is no description of that suspect. We're told a lot of kids live in this area. A walk to the bus stop turned into a scary ordeal for a Churchland High School student Thursday morning. Well, this morning when I saw the officers' cars down here kind of early, I was like, what is the police doing down here this time of the morning? And then uh, we had a robocall, I guess, from the school. Portsmouth police say the girl was walking around 645 to catch the bus when an unknown man approached her and assaulted her. It's not clear where the man came from or if he got away on foot or by car. To know that somebody's running around here that er early in the morning trying to prey on young girls or boys, it's kind of upsetting. There's a lot of crazy people out here now, so when you hear things like that, you start to get more alarmed. One of your, was it your kid or what's the safety out there? Officers stood watch at the school and at the bus stop Thursday afternoon. Police didn't release a description of the suspect, but the situation has parents and guardians on edge. I would say majority of the area probably have uh, kids that come out and use this use the school bus. Neighbors we spoke to say the high school bus stop area isn't well lit. They want the stop moved closer to the apartment complex parking lot or a neighborhood monitor to stand watch. In the meantime, they're staying vigilant. I don't want to be out here and, and he mess with one of these children because it's going to be a problem. Police have not released any other details, but if we get more information, we will be sure to pass that along to you. So stay with Wavy News for any updates on this story. Reporting in Portsmouth, Gina Arevalo, 10 on your side.